What's going on, YouTube? This is your neighborhood draft king, Attic, bringing my top picks for Monday's main DK MLB slate, guys. All right. So, if you love DFS like I do, guys, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you can get, get my videos and notifications. And also, guys, drop a comment for me below and let me know which sport is your favorite daily fantasy sport. All right. All right, guys. So, let's get into today's top picks, guys. So, on the MLB slate today, it looks like we have eight games on the slate. All righty. So, as you can see on the screen, these are my top picks for this particular slate. All right, guys. So, the way that I choose my plays is this. I go into draft dashboard. I go to position optimize, and I click on each position, and then I sort it by the draft rank or dash rank. My apologies. All right. And as you can see, Charlie Blackman is on the top right here. And if you scroll down, you got a couple of different options. And if you hover over this... Um, this uh, little percentage right here, it shows you their OPS versus the handedness of the pitcher and also the pitcher's OPS versus the the hitter's uh, handedness or whatever. So as you can see, Aaron Hicks is in a good spot with a 23% advantage. You know, if you scroll down, you got Springer here in the good spot. And so it pretty much gives you the data that shows you which player is in the best spot, either versus, you know, the pitcher that they're facing or, or whatever. So check it out, guys. In the description of this video is a link for a seven-day trial, one buck. Again, to me, it's very easy to do my MLB research because uh, it puts all the data that you need right here in front of you guys. So, all right, let's get on to the top picks, guys. So, for my pitcher, guys, I'm going with uh, Carrasco as my SP1. All right, so if you look at this guy's uh, data versus uh, – the team that he's facing, guys, Baltimore, again, is at dead last. And when it comes to strikeout percentage, so they're, they're striking out a lot versus righties. And, uh, you know, yes, this team gave Kluber a run for his money, right? But I like Carrasco. He's faced his team before in Baltimore before and put up 33 DraftKings points, all right? So I like his chances of doing that again, guys. And uh, I'm rolling with him for 11-7. I do like Gary Cole, but, you know, the L.A., the Angels, man, that's a pretty nice team, guys, and they've been hitting well versus righty. But Gary Cole is a what I consider to be an elite pitcher, guys. Look at his stats, man. But Gary Cole is another player that you can go with. But me personally, um, I'm going to go with Carrasco. I think he has a better chance, in my opinion. But um, either one or, or would be a good play, guys. All right. So at first base, this guy actually is multi-position eligible, as you can see, first base and second base. But I like this guy, Kaike Hernandez. Uh, I believe he's batting – uh, where is he at? L.A. Dodge. I think he's batting like second or third. Okay, he's batting third. All right. So, uh, versus Garcia, four miles per hour going out. Okay, but I like his chances at his price. All right. He's only 3.3K. So, I like his chances of putting up a nice nice little uh, points for us there, guys. He should be able to get a couple of hits, as you can see in the last couple of games. He's uh, put up some decent points. So, I like his chances here versus Miami, guys. All right, next up is my second baseman, uh, Jed Lowry. I just love this guy, man. He has six home runs on the year already. He's playing in Texas, which is a good spot. And um, I like his chances of, of getting one out the park, guys. He has 15 at-bats versus this team, six hits, cup RBIs, guys. All right. He has an o OPS of 1.07, an average of 0 .40 which is great in MLB numbers, guys. So I like Jed Lowry's chances, and uh, he's ranked high for second base over on draft dashboard. All right. Next up is my outfield. I kind of talked about him already when I was talking about draft dashboard, but I like Charlie Blackman, guys. All right. He's facing a righty in Colorado, a.k.a. Coors Field, guys. Lock him in. He, he, he's going to – one is leaving the park, guys. I'm going to go ahead and call it. So – I'm locking in Charlie Blackman, guys. And then also I talked about Springer as well. He has a nice matchup versus his right-handed um, – I'm sorry, left-handed pitcher. All right, so, again, you got Springer versus lefty. You just play him, guys. I, I like his chances of uh, putting up some decent points. He's batting leadoff, which means he's going to get four to five chances at the at the plate. And I like his chances of putting up some points, guys, getting a couple of hits or RBIs or even maybe uh, knocking one out the park, guys. So And he's at home. So I like George Springer, guys. So, of course, I don't think I'm going to play all these plays all together, guys, right? Because I would have to give me a very, very cheap pitcher or a very, very cheap outfielder. But these are just my top plays for the day, guys. So if you want my player pool, all right, just go over to the draft dashboard via the link in my description. All right. 
And when you go to your account and you go to watch players, you can click on watch DK Addicts picks right here. And it'll load in my picks into your uh, draft dashboard. And then you can just go over to the lineup optimizer and let it optimize your lineup, guys. So, all right. So good luck on tomorrow's slate, guys. All right. Remember, eight games. MLB is a marathon, not a sprint. All right. So proper bankroll management. You must practice, guys. All right. Because you're going to have players in a good spot, in a good uh, with good numbers versus the particular pitcher, and they can go and put up a donut. That's just MLB for you guys. Or a guy who has bad numbers versus the pitcher handedness gets a hold of one of the pitches and knocks it out of the park for a three run home run. It happens, guys. All right. So you play the numbers. Hopefully it works out for you. If not, you try again tomorrow. But good luck on tomorrow, Slay, guys, and I'll see you on the next video.